the drama never stops, be it on screen or off screen. And once again, the actor himself, Scott Clifton, has come out to address a very important and scary situation going on. He issues a heads up among people to watch out for scammers, either pretending to be him or other actors. So let's get to the bottom of this right away. Hey everyone, welcome to Trend Street. We all know Scott Clifton, aka Liam Spencer, from Bold and the Beautiful, is an active person on social media. If there's anything to call out, he does it and always shows his support for the right causes. And like always, he has come to his social media to discuss a very important issue that's been practically plaguing the social media. On his break from filming scenes on set, Clifton took some time out to post a video on his Instagram to talk about the increasing problem of scammers and imposters that's going around and all of us need to hear about it, so we can be safe from it too. Clifton, visibly concerned, emphasized that this wasn't the kind of topic he'd prefer discussing on social media, but here he is. In the video, he recounted his previous mentions of the imposter problem, and how it has affected not only him, but also his followers and fellow actors. He stressed the growing problem of the issue, revealing that lives have been ruined, not just of the fans but also the actors, due to these scams. Interrupted by the studio intercom, Clifton pressed on to share a shocking incident that occurred just a month ago. Someone posing as one of his co-stars convinced a woman to poison her husband. Yup, you heard that right. The victim in this disturbing case was Roxanne Doucette, from Townsend, Massachusetts, who believed she was in contact with Torsten Kay, the actor portraying Ridge. Reports from Boston detailed how Doucette had been scammed into giving money to the impersonator, before being manipulated into attempting something as horrifying as poisoning her husband. One chilling screenshot even read, You have to get rid of your husband, honey. I need you so much. Clifton expressed his deep concern about the escalating danger saying, this is getting scarier and scarier, this is a very real, very dangerous problem. Now, although he knows it isn't easy to solve this problem, he revealed that Annika Noel, who plays Hope on the show, had drafted a letter to the authorities, who assured them they were investigating. It's not clear how we're going to solve this problem other than to keep hammering home that. I will not reach out to you as a fan in any capacity like that, he stated. I'm never going to ask you for money. I'm never going to just randomly start a romantic relationship with you over a private message." He pleaded with everyone to stay vigilant and not fall victim to such scams, urging them to protect themselves. Clifton also encouraged fans to be skeptical and cautious, assuring them that he is actively working on fixing this. And that's not all, after his video message he also pointed out some more facts in his caption that everyone needs to know and do. The first one is, if you come across an imposter account, please block and report them. Second, he does not use TikTok, Facebook, or anything besides Instagram for connecting and sharing with fans. Third, read someone's handle closely. If it's not at CliftonCam exactly, it isn't him. Look for underscores, hyphens, numbers, etc. Dead giveaway. Fourth, the most important one, ask strangers to prove they are who they say they are. Think critically about whether what they tell you actually proves what it's supposed to. And last but not the least, as he said, please spread the word. So, let's all be smart about this and not get fooled by these online scammers and imposters. Let's all make sure everyone is aware about this scary situation and make sure to inform your friends and family too. Let us all thank Clifton for spreading the word as well and drop some of your thoughts in the comments below too. Thank you for checking this video out. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for new videos every day. Turn that bell notification on if you want to hear from us and comment down below if you've subscribed and we'll make sure to reply and thank as many of you as we possibly can.